Welcome back to Living It Away, everybody. Now, there's an exciting music festival happening soon that we want to tell you about. And here to give us an exclusive sneak peek, we bring in our friend, Jake, the ukulele master, Shimabukuro. Do you like how I said that? <laughs> <laughs> I was, I'm glad that you didn't read the lead before we... <laughs> I want to throw you off of it. Oh, always, how are you, brother? Always great to see you. Thank you for having Good me. Good to see on. you. You know, uh, I haven't seen Jake actually since Sunday, so yeah, good to see you again. Right, yes. uh, now, before we actually get into the music festival that we want to tell everybody about, let's tell them about your upcoming album. It's called Grateful. Give everybody um, an insight into the album. Yeah, it's a uh, well, it's a very special record. Uh, you know, I, it's a duets album where I got to work with all of my heroes, all the musicians that I grew up listening to, and you know, and some some other ones that you know maybe even a little younger than me, but like you know, Henry Capono's on there. We mm -hmm. got. Brother Nolan, Kavika Kahiapo, nice. I mean, it's just Kimi and Minor, just so many, um, and uh, and just, it was just a collaborative effort. You know, there's 22 songs on wow. it. We had no idea it was gonna be that long. Right. But for me, it's just a personal record because it really brings me home, back to my roots, and okay. I'm just so proud, you know, to have been collaborating with all these amazing musicians. Cool, so grateful to be home grateful to be working with all of these musicians is that basically where yeah. the title came from i mean yeah it's it's actually a song that justin kavika young wrote okay. that's also on the record Sounds and it's just about just being um you know being grateful for the things that you have awesome and that's you know the path to true happiness and uh you know and there's a japanese saying okage sama day which means i am what i am because of you awesome and all these artists you know on this record i feel like i wouldn't be the person or the musician that I am today if it weren't for their yeah. inspiration. Yeah, leading the path, helping you along your own path, mm -hmm. you know, and vice versa. Um, now, you mentioned a few of the musicians that are a part of the album. What was the thought process of, uh, you know, bringing them together? Why why these particular musicians? Uh, well, I mean, there, there are so many that I that I wanted to ask. You know, this this would have been like a five or six album, you know, yeah, yeah. Uh, project. Um, but, you know, it's just... Um, uh, I guess we had to, I mean, for me, though, you know, going up to someone like Henry Capono and asking him to record with you, you know, that's not something you would normally do, right? Were you nervous? But, oh, yeah, I mean, but, <laughs> but, you know, I never would have asked him if it wasn't yeah. for this, uh, just by coincidence, I happened to sit next to him on the airplane, okay. you know, on a flight home. And I remember, like, walking onto the plane, I saw him sitting, and I looked, oh, my goodness, that's my seat. So I went up and I was like, oh, Uncle Henry, hey, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. is it okay if I sit there? And he looked at me, he's like, what, is that your seat? I was like, yeah. yeah. So he said, well, I guess you better sit there. Yeah. But the whole flight home, you know, we talked and, um, and you know, so I, I asked him if he'd want to do this with me. Nice. And he was like, he was like, yeah, he came into the studio and we played sailing and it was just, oh, there you just go. such a moment. Yeah. Yeah. It was history made. I love it. Um, okay. So not only are you bringing everybody together for your album, but everybody is also coming together for your Hanoho Music Festival. Tell everybody about the inspiration behind this festival. Yeah, so this was uh, the idea, you know, this was, um, the idea was last year we were talking about putting together an international music festival where we would bring musicians from all over the world, you know, of different genres, like okay. there's jazz, blues, you know, but, but integrating them into all the local artists here, you know, because yeah. it's just, you know, there's a very special thing that I think Right. musicians hawaii-based musicians have and bring right. right so uh so that was that was the idea behind it and then uh, of course you know uh, um a couple weeks ago after you know we all mm -hmm. know what's what's happening with the maui community we uh we wanted to pivot to uh um, to a fundraiser and that's what we're doing and mick fleetwood is really helping us to lead the way him and jeff peterson you know mm -hmm. both Maui residents and um, you know they're coming over for this festival. It's going to be two days at the Hawaii Theater, and just um, and just all the uh, all of the the proceeds are going to the Hawaii families. Community Foundation. You know their Maui Strong Fund. Okay, so uh, two nights at the Hawaii Theater is called the Hanaho Music Festival. What can audience expect from this festival, and how can they get tickets? I mean, uh, yeah. So we're also doing a, a virtual a virtual stream as well. Mm -hmm. But, you know, the, the main idea is, you know, I think, like, music um, serves a different purpose for everyone, right? I mean, it's, it's, it's so powerful, but in its own way for each individual. And we just hope that that experience, you know, whatever, all these artists coming together and just showing their love and support, you know, for Maui. Of course, we want to raise funds. Right. But we just hope that the music and the artistry of everyone involved just serves exactly what each individual awesome. needs right now. 
Jake, awesome. Thank you so much for taking care of our um, Hawaii community, our music community. Thank you guys, you. the website right there, it's jakeshimabukuro.com. You can find more information there. We're also going to have it on kh12.com. It's the Grateful Album and the Honolulu Music Festival happening the weekend of September 8th. You're going to not want to miss it. All details on kh12.com. Thank you so much, Jake. Good Thanks, to see you, brother. Thank you. Always great to see you. All right.